hey, hey, you probably got the same email that I did that said that YouTube was going to be changing their platform a bit and they're going to be taking your unlisted videos that were uploaded before January 1st and making them private starting January 23rd, 2021. Well, for those of you that are like us, Jennifer Rothschild, that has multiple videos that are unlisted and embedded in other websites, well, this becomes quite a concern and it's a lot of work to be able to do some of the things that YouTube is asking you to do. So they give you a couple different options as to what you can do. You can do nothing. You can opt out of this change. You can make your unlisted content public where you can re-upload new a new unlisted content. Man, that's a heavy, heavy deal. So listen, here's the option. This is what we decided to do. We decided to go here and take a look at how many videos would be affected. That would jump us to our pages that would show us the videos that are actually going to be affected. And here you can see that it kind of outlines for you videos that were uploaded before 2017. They're listed unlisted. And here they are in a nice pattern. That's really helpful. Well, I immediately saw that some of these videos were embedded in important information that we wanted that to be unlisted, but available to the public that had the unlisted link. So obviously we don't we we needed to choose some kind of an option here. So what we decided to do is we decided to take this option that's highlighted right here for you back to the email, and you can either do nothing. Or this is the best option in my view. It is filling out this form found right here and opt out of this change. For me personally, this is what I did. It brings you to an easy to, easy to fill out form where you put only your channel ID. Your channel ID is located here under YouTube slash channel. And in our situation, it is right up here located under YouTube channel. And if you get this extension right here, and you copy that after channel. Obviously, you're gonna select that. That's gonna be your content. Then you paste it in and you will find that it's easy to fill out in this form. Right here, you opt in out of that, you submit, and the net result is your email has been sent and you'll have op op options that will inform you uh, within about 24 hours. So that's my two minute help to uh, those of you that have questions about what options would be beneficial for you. Thanks so much for tuning in.